Hey guys! Hey guys! We're the Dorkery. We're the Dorkery. And today we are at Universal Studios Orlando. Yes, we have a friend in town, so right? we have so much fun things planned this week. But we I are starting out here at Universal Studios. We're going to ride all the rides, eat all the food, have a great time. We are staying until close tonight. We're starting Whoa. out in the morning and we're Nobody staying until close. It's going to be amazing. I'm going to have to take some breaks. <laughs> All the stars out today at Universal. We got Marilyn and the Simpsons. I want to see, I really want to see Scooby-Doo out here today though. That's what I'm looking forward to. Maybe a little later. The mystery machine. The mystery machine. We are having lunch at Mel's Drive-In and I'm actually really pleased with the comfort of the seating area in here. I thought it was going to be crazy. I thought it was going to feel like a cafeteria and we were going to be fighting for seats, but it's really nice. Really open, lots of seats to choose from, and part of the reason is if you can see this is there's a line at the door and they only let people in when there is a spot for them to order at the counter. So they're letting people, families in one family at a time, which the reason this helps, it's not hot, out, hot outside today, so that's good, but it helps because people can't just come in and grab tables before they've ordered. So when you do order and get your food, there's plenty of places for you to eat. And I always love when restaurants do this because it just makes more sense. You don't need a table till you have food. And if everyone grabs a table before they order, it just messes up the process. One thing we've been doing a lot lately since it's so much hotter is bringing our reusable cups with us to the parks. I think the initial purchase on these is $20 for a day. Um, that's the initial purchase. And then when we bring it back with us, it's $12 for the day. And considering that most drinks are anywhere from $5 to $6 each, that's a really good deal. I love it. Guys, Rockin' Robin is playing right now. The whole restaurant. I love this little area. I love all the details at Universal. Just checking out the buildings, Drew. What are you doing? Cafe La Bamba. Do you la 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 bamba? Uh, what was that? What ever happened to that guy? I know he uh, he showed up on that FX show. What was it? What are you talking about? The like the actor from the movie? Yeah. Uh, I'm talking about the song. Lou Diamond? No. Yeah. What was his name? No, Lou Diamond. Is that right? Let's do some research. <laughs> Getting ready for Halloween Horror Nights. This is where their little swamp creatures are going to be. Excited or not excited? I'm, you know what? I I'm like a good swamp creature. And these are real plants. That excites me. I'm not like thrilled with the house chases this year, but sometimes when that happens, it ends up being the scariest years. You can't Chelsea. really be scared by, like, Stranger Things. But you can be scared by, like, some of the things that you're, like, not expecting or you weren't really I have wanting. a question as we're passing. I've looked at all of these, and I feel like in every scene of their little swamp fake area, they have tires. Do people that live in, like, yeah, three, three swamp tires. lands, they just throw all their tires yeah. in the swamps? Is that where, I'll, that's where Absolutely. we recycle our tires? Absolutely. Because, I mean, who's going to go out there and be like, protect the swamps? Huh, news <laughs> to me. Get in. Little E.T. Rabbit. Did you wear ears in the movie? No. He's eating? He's eating. He's eating. He's eating. He's eating. Oh, 
find the one you call E.T. Bring him home to the green planet. His friend, the deeply moot moot, needs a healing touch. Heed my call. Take headed. He said take headed. Take me. No, no one heeded. No one took headed. Bring E.T. home. Where'd he go? No, he beamed up. Oh, he beamed up. Keep your cards to yourself. E.T. Go home. Get ready. Cups, Hogsmeade, and Diagon Alley. Also, oh, keychains. I don't know if I've ever seen this line before. I must have not been in here in a while. Buy tickets to a Quidditch tournament at the travel agency. All the different times and time zones you can travel to. I'm assuming that we're probably traveling by fireplace to some places. What you doing? 
bags for the cup. Smart. I have always wanted a night bus t-shirt. This is actually pretty cool too. It looked purple. Is it just me? Because it's above the sweatshirt. It looks purple. But I actually, you know, I like that. That's a good hat. Look. We have I haven't drank out of that coffee mug in a long time. And I would love to. See, I've just always thought this t-shirt was cute. It is cute. And I've never bought it. Wow. Ow. I don't know. I've looked at it many times. I actually kind of like the sleeveless one too. With a little bralette. That would be comfy. <gasps> okay, no, I kind of like this one. For the hot. What does it say on the back? I kind of like that. It's fun for a uh, universal day. I really like it in here. I don't know why I've never been in here. If I have, I don't remember it. Travel tours. You get your tickets up here. Postcards. How are you today? I'm great. How are you? Good. That's fun. I love the way you have these organized. Yes, I've, I've, I've put a lot of I, It's things. actually, I'm, I'm loving like, it. I see one is off Hold on, one this one's off just a little things. bit. <laughs> well, I think I put it, I think it needs to scooch. Okay, you and I would be great yeah. friends. Yeah. You're yeah. welcome at my house anytime. <laughs> Fantastic, <I'll> see you <laughs> I love these too, these are fun. Suitcases, these are good, that's a good carry-on. I like that one. I might need to add that to my collection. Which mask, Drew? I like the second one from the right with the mouth kind of looks like it's locked. I think it looks like keyholes. It's very it's very old school Deadpool, right? Mm. When he didn't talk. Hey, Drew, let me see your shirt. <laughs> We're here. We're here. It is. <laughs> what do you got? What do you got? A spell marker. Oh, interesting. Mm. They have Death Eater mask for sale for $10. These used to be $30. They got like a little strap on the back. Sorry, you can't see that because it's so dark in here, but a little strap on the back. Just like a kid's mask, kind of. It's kind of fun. <laughs> All right, look at this. As I always say this wrong. You say it and I'll repeat you. Bellatrix is what I say. But then I feel like you always laugh at how I say it. Bellatrix. Because sometimes I say Beatrix, like Beatrix Potter. But this is her mask. Look at how the jawline looks just like her jawline. When he puts it back down. It's down. Shoot. You will put the shirt down. There you go. There you go. A little over his ear. A little over his ear action. Looks like her jawline. I'm gonna take a tour of the Green Dots Bank. Nice and air conditioned in here. My favorite thing is all this green stone. Is that weird? That I'm just like, hmm, that would look pretty in my house. I like green and brown. All right, that's random. some gold sitting over here. We can will off. Put in our account. Maybe take a cruise. I would really like to have, has anybody seen like the new cruise ship they're working on for Disney? That's the one I want to book on. It's got like the Haunted Mansion Lounge.
Make your way to the security room, where your three identification photo will be taken. Then, go directly to the officer's end of the car. I didn't understand anything you said. Somehow opening the canal. That's all I heard. <laughs> he, he was giving instructions. They were not. I think he speaks a different language. If you would like to open an account. Obituary? Dumbledore? Dumbledore died? I'm just kidding. Remember. Headmaster for Hogwarts. Severus Snape. That's a big spoiler though, if you haven't seen the movie. <laughs> Fireworks from my brother's friend George. Bilberis, what are you doing? This is my office, Lord Apple. The question is, what are you doing here? I was about to show our new clients the world. I'll just get to the keys. Well, I moved them. All you have to do is ask. Accio Keys. Hmm. How did you get in here? We have to see you. Well, I'll never keep you from your tour. I just need to pick up a few things and I'll be on my way. You haven't seen me. <laughs> Actually, if you don't mind, I'll join you on your tour. We can all leave together. I'll meet you at your cars. But what are we talking about? Well, let's get moving. Now, listen to me. The passage to your left will take you to a pair of the Always ask for a front row. Sometimes it doesn't matter. I feel like this one goes. You know what that is? Ogre snot. Ogre snot? No? Stalagmites? Stalagmites. Visiting the tribute store today again. I just love little details. Like you get to get your little movie rental card. There's new releases this week. Ooh, the mega movie parade. That's about to start in about 30 minutes. Scan here to find out more. I love like the rentals. Please return your rentals here. And someone dropped theirs off on the counter. A little floppy disk action. What does it say? Mega Castle Arcade and Poly. Mega Mage. I don't know. I can't read upside down. Out of order. Escape into the movies like never before with two unique adventures. Find yourself in a secret genetics lab and use your wits to avoid becoming the prey in Jurassic World Escape. Or stop Biff Tannen from sabotaging the timeline and back to the future out of time. Look at those old Nintendo cartridges. Is that Terminator? Yep. And then Jaws, Ghostbusters, and Back to the Future. I love the Nintendo Back to the Future game. I would love to play that again. I had that exact television. Yeah? Yep. It is. You should take it camping. What's on the Lord of the Dance? I had that exact VHS day. No, you didn't. My dad had all the Lord of the Dance. And then when he got Simon and Garfunkel. In Central Park. Please return your rentals. Insert joke here. Sorry. You're good. I Every love I all the here, small details. It like I just want to take pictures of some of these movies and go home and just watch them. <laughs> I really enjoyed watching the movie last night in our movie room. I did too. We watched Fall Guy last night. Right. I wish that we had done one of these. This is fun. So this is the video. This is where you are the, sorry, the personal photos you could have done. 
and see it's like then they put you on a movie cover and then when the store is done you get to take your movie cover home with you have it at your house somebody did their cat's photo I think it's so fun
It's time for Here Come the Men in Black. Galaxy Defenders. We are waiting for Cine Sational. Cine Sensational. Cine Sensational. Yes. Cine Sensational. I'm just here for Back to the Future. Cine. C I N E Sational. Okay. It's the new show on the water at Universal. They do a show of projections in the fountains okay. and fireworks. All right. And this Blues Brothers music is in a bad way to wait. Let's go. Down that dusty road. I got a truck load.
harmonies and inspire us all to live out our own epic adventures. A wonderful evening. I enjoyed that show. That was the first time I've seen it. First time I've seen it. Didn't even know there was drones in it. There was drones. It was like they took every show that anyone has ever done and they were like, You want water? We got water. You yep. want projections? Yep. We got projections. You fireworks? want fireworks? We got fireworks. Music? You want music? We got music. You want drones? We got drones. They're the only ones though that have Back to the Future. Yeah, it was pretty cool though. My biggest thought of the day is that yesterday when we decided we were going to spend the entire day almost open to close at Universal. My biggest concern was the heat. Yeah. And I asked specifically, okay, can we go ahead and talk about like where at Universal do they have places to chill out when it gets too hot? Because at Disney, we know where like our like overheated spots are, where we go just for air conditioning and rest. Yeah. I did not feel like I needed that one time here. So many of their queues and their walkthrough places are already they even had a cool zone. Yeah, there are so many just natural cooling spaces that the few minutes that you had to walk from ride to ride in the sun, yeah. you didn't even notice because everywhere else, every ride, everything else you did was in a cooled off area. So that was my note for Universal. It, it. it shouldn't be that unbearable on really hot days. And I'm glad to know that. That's oh, good to know. Anyways, we got more fun in store tomorrow. And in the meantime, go dork yourself. Pew, pew. Pew, pew.